stupid. But going after your own sister, shame on you. Shame on you. What? You're talking crazy. Look, Veda is a liar. You can't trust anything she says. Get off my way. Get off me. Get off me. I'm so sorry. Look, I ain't got no money to put my mama in the ground, okay? Honey, I'm not here for that. But I'm sure there are some people that will help you bury your mother. <laughs> if you lead her to the state, you will never know what happened to her. I know what happened to her. She hustled, then she died. Keisha, you supposed to be sleeping. Mama? I told you, don't call me mama. Kids in my class were laughing at me because I have no daddy. You don't? Daisy, everybody's got a mama and a daddy. If your teacher says so, then it's true. Everybody's got a daddy. Everybody except you. What do I want you to remember? His name is Jehovah sing praises to him, a father of the fatherless and a judge of the widows. You got a mother and you got God and nothing else matters. God forgot me a long time ago. Now it's my turn.
Uh, Ooh. Come on, I worked really hard on those. <laughs> I'm sure you did, babe. It's okay, Daddy. They're not as bad as last time. Uh, oh, come here, honey. I'm sorry. Oh. Hey, guess what? I was able to get us a reservation at Shea Cashmere for tonight. Dinner, dancing, maybe make the B-A-B-Y we've been talking about. That you've been talking about, but I can't tonight. Oh, come on, baby. It took me weeks Ow. to make this reservation. Mm. It's okay. Sorry, babe. Uh, big fire's at work. Sorry. It's always gonna be something. Oh, I'll make it up to you, I promise. I like the sound of that. <laughs> hey, um, have you heard from Daddy? He hasn't returned my text in the last two days. Well, that's interesting. He was supposed to watch the game yesterday, but he never answered my calls, so... Mm, I'll swing by his place after work. Mm. Mm. Hey, it's not much better than what I did. Uh, yes, it is. Oh, it's better than what I did? Yes. Whatever. Sorry, Daddy. Fair. Life on the road was hard. There were months I barely saw your mom. I don't, but I don't, you and mom were happy. We loved each other very much. <sighs> My dearest Elijah, I have a confession. I did not have that abortion. Dad. Her name is Keisha. I never told her about you because I didn't want her to feel rejected like I feel. And I'm hoping you will give her the... I'm sorry, Kate. I made a terrible mistake, but I loved your mother with all my heart. I'm just trying to reconcile all of this with the man who raised me. The man who sings in the choir every Sunday. I can't believe you, Daddy. I love you, Daddy. Nothing will ever change that. I really don't think Daddy's wrong for wanting to get to know Keisha. I mean, I'm such a Daddy's girl, and I couldn't imagine anything worse than growing up without a dad. I mean, famine, war, morning sickness. Oh, Reagan, stop it! <laughs> Oh, I'm here for you guys, whatever you decide. You can't just walk away. Well, what does your pop say? It looks like Daddy has pretty much decided. 
Justice's people this morning. They do not like our strategy for his new Justice shoe collection. Oh, yes. I know, he wants something younger and fresher or we're fired. Uh, I'm aware. Yeah. I need you to stay here, work on strategy, and I will go and deal with Keisha. You have a better relationship with Justice. Thank you, Reagan. Mm, that's what friends are for. <laughs> I will take my pregnant baby bump oh. <laughs> all the way to Arkansas because I love you. Oh. And I will deal with Keisha. <laughs> and you are my best friend. She thinks she's cute. <laughs> I'll show her cute. <laughs> oh, shit. You know they don't listen to us. They don't listen to what you gotta say. Keisha Jones? Baby, I'm gonna have Alicia finish pinning you up right here in this next chair. Reagan Givens. I'm here on behalf of my client. Mm hmm She may be your sister. She and your father would love to meet you. I don't have a sister. And I was always told I didn't have a father. Are you here to tell me different? Um, your father's name is Elijah Wilson. Is there somewhere else we can talk? Someone more private. Yeah. Mm. You never wondered about your father? Nah, my mama was enough for me. I'm sure she was a lovely lady, but don't you want to meet your daddy and your sister? I gotta work. I got bills to pay. Look, take your time. So Gabrielle isn't checking for me? I never mentioned that name. Sure you did. Whatever you decide, I will respect. Call me anytime. Look, I'll call you. You do that. Now, if you want that type of speed, you need to change your RAM from DDR2 to DDR3. Okay. Okay, that means your ports are not compatible, sir. Okay, but we can do the upgrade. It's just gonna, you know, it's gonna cost you. It ain't gonna be cheap. Guess who came up into the salon today? Oh, sorry, Ooh. excuse me. Reagan, Gabrielle's BFF. You, uh, Afro man, come on, hit the dope, dog. Come on, you ain't got no money. She came up in there like, surprise, you got a family. Ooh, that's great, boo. That's great. Cause we about to have their lives turned upside down. Gabrielle didn't even come to find me. I mean, she the one that got everything. My daddy. She got a daughter too. Cute as hell. So, what's your plan now? I'm going to the ATL and I'm gonna take what's mine. 
you know, get a taste of that hot life. They money. And anything else I can get my hands on? Okay. Well, you know, I got my boy Q on standby. And all we need is the bank information, then we got the rest. Finally. So, what do you think? What's she like? I don't trust her. I spoke with the landlady at her old place, and she told me Keisha skipped out on four months' rent. Well, her mom just died. She's probably down on her luck. There's something else. The landlord said Keisha's been a little off ever since. Since what? She lost her baby that would have been the same age as Bella. Can't even imagine. I mean, do you think she's even gonna come? Oh, hold on, she's texting me right now. Like I said, she's in. We'll be there tomorrow. Let's talk details later. Thank you so much, Reagan. You are amazing. Talk tomorrow. <sighs> Princess Bella has requested that the queen of the house tuck her in tonight. Oh, did she? <laughs> That's sweet. Well, that was Reagan. Looks like we're gonna meet Keisha tomorrow. Okay. You sure about this? I've heard some pretty terrifying DNA tracing stories gone wrong. Yeah, it's what daddy wants. What do you want? For this to have never happened. Oh, but it looks like it's too late for that now. You know what I want? Mm. You know what I want. Oh, don't you start. But I want to put our daughter to bed. You stop it. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> That's mm. I gotta answer that? Hello? Keisha, you on the plane yet? Nah. But I wish you were coming with me, man. Reagan is such a bitch. Look, don't worry about her, okay? Keep your little pretty eyes on the prize, and we'll be rolling in cash in no time. Yeah. I can't wait to get out there and do what I gotta do. Who's your little friend? Are you spying on me? <laughs> Sounds like an interesting conversation y'all were having. No, it was my boss. I'm supposed to be working, remember? Mm-hmm. best to let Reagan bring Keisha here. I'm sure she'll be here any minute now. I, I, I just, I just want her to feel welcome. And she will. Oh. sister. Me neither. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here. Well, looks like we have a lot of catching up to do. Yeah. Come on, let's, let's go inside. Girl, I gotta get this baby to bed. <laughs> here are the test documents. Documents? Uh, yeah, the documents no, it's, that... it's nothing. I'll see you later. Uh, Have a good night. You get some sleep. Uh, good night. What documents? Oh, it's nothing, Daddy. Look, I don't want to cause no trouble. 
No, no, it's it's it, it, it's all right, Ellen. We're glad you're here. What's going on, Gabrielle? Daddy, can we please just talk about this later? I don't want there to be any more secrets between us, Carl. Paternity says. I'm being cautious. It's been really lonely. And I'm just happy I have people now. Look, I'll do whatever y'all want me to do. No, it's, it's, it's all right, sweetheart. Thank you. Thank you. I don't need a paternity test to know that Keisha is my daughter. Daddy, it's a necessary precaution. You no? said it yourself. I chose not to believe Daisy all those years ago. I'm not going to make the same mistake again. Now, I thought you were on board with me. Okay? I'm here, aren't I? Look, it's just, it's been a stressful night, all right? How about we all just get some sleep and start fresh in the morning? I'll get your couch ready. Is this my bed? No, I'm sorry, Keisha, I don't have a spare room. Yeah, I've been trying to get Daddy to move somewhere bigger. Well, I've been comfortable here for a long time. Wasn't no reason to change things till now. I mean, this is the nicest thing I've ever had. I'll tell you what, you, you take my room. What? No, 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 no. Yeah. Daddy. Keisha, you can stay with me. No, it's fine, really. No, my place is bigger and you'll have privacy. And it'll give us some time to get to know each other. Yeah, it means a lot to see my two girls get along. What do you say, Keisha? Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'll get my keys. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm just going to check in with my husband. See your room? Yeah. It's right up here? Yeah. Okay. They couldn't tell you forged the letter, right? Yo, I'm tripping off these pictures, man. Look, she got it beyond that. You think it's bigger than Cousins Q's triple wide? This is on a whole other level. There ain't no storm coming and blowing this place down. What? <laughs> Show me. Do a video. No. I don't want to look like I'm creeping around her house. So they nice? They cool. Elijah's all crying and stuff. He knows he did me dirty. Well, what about Gabrielle? I mean, I know how to play her. Look, I didn't come here for friends. Me and Daisy hustled my whole life. All right, I'll start looking for account numbers tomorrow. Gabrielle Flores, executor, sole heir.
That's it. <laughs> Just like the Congo line we did last night, huh? Yeah. Everyone oh. started laughing too. Then we had a paint party. You sure oh, did. I bet all the moms just love that. <laughs> Daddy did too. Really? Yeah, that's oh. right. Because uh, Daddy was the only man at the mother of daughter night. Huh. But it's all good, because Belle and I had fun anyway, didn't we? Mm -hmm. We even won the dance competition, Pops. Oh, yeah? Really? You want to show Grandpa moves? Come on. Oh, yeah, let me see. Come on. Ready? And then, 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 Let's just continue with our plan. It's all good, baby girl. Any line on the old man's door? Yeah, I found Elijah's will. He's given everything to Gabby, but I'm changed that. How you gonna do that, Keisha? All I need is for him to take a paternity test. Once we have legal proof that I'm his daughter, the rest is easy. Keep your eyes on the prize. Gotta go. Daddy wanted to come up, but I thought maybe you might want to talk to your sister. Look, I know that seeing us all together down there probably made you think of your mom. I'm really sorry. Yeah. <sighs> she was all the family I had. Trust me, I get that. My mom passed away, too. Really? I didn't know. Well, when she died seven years ago, I felt like I could barely breathe. But day by day, I cried less and less. And now I'm able to smile when I think of her. Someday you will, too. Keisha, if it helps, you're not alone anymore. You want to come downstairs and have breakfast with your family? <laughs> yeah. Um, your better half took the baby to ballet. Got it. I'm gonna make some tea. Hey. Hey. You are? Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> good. I'm gonna fix your plate. Yeah. Ooh, this floor is cold. I I'm gonna go upstairs and get some shoes. You were sad yesterday. Are you gonna live with us now? And Keisha's gonna be staying with us for as long as she wants. Can I bring her to school for show and tell? <laughs> <laughs> what y'all do? Well, Mauricio is an accountant, and Reagan and I started our own PR agency. Did it, uh, did it take a lot of money to start your company? Well, Reagan's family made a generous investment to get us up and running. Y'all must be rolling in it. <laughs> <laughs> we do fine. I mean, we've been really blessed to have a couple of big clients. Mm. You ever heard of Big Justice? The rapper? More like a thug. Well, I love Justice. And his sneakers are dope. I mean, it's like perfect old meets new school. But... For what? It's the way he's selling them is just straight old school. What do you mean? Okay, like, like his last shoes, 
they came out at all the big stores at the same time but you build more hype when you surprise people have a a scavenger hunt for hidden sneakers scavenger uh, hide a dozen signed pairs with little hints on his social media for, for people to find. I mean, his, his pickup post would be blowing up with those shoes. Trust me. Right, fella? All right, we're here. <laughs> All right, look at these people. So does your mom uh, fix your hair? Sometimes, but she's a very busy woman. Yeah, well, I'll twist you up sometime. <laughs> you know, your mom is my sister, so that makes me your auntie. Like Aunt Reagan? Better. I hope we can be friends sometime. Would you like that? All right. <laughs> Time for Sunday school. I could take her. Can she please? Uh, look, kiddo. We're all going to Grandpa's after church, so you'll be able to see her then, okay? Mm -hmm. It's really okay, you don't have to. No, really, I'm happy to. Okay, just right upstairs on the right. Good to see you. Actually, this is my, my daughter, Keisha. Keisha, good to meet you. And of course, you know this one right here. This is my friend right there. How you doing? I like those shoes, too. Listen, your family is a big part of this house. And I hope you feel at home here. Okay? Yeah. All right. Good All right. I'll see y'all later. Good to meet you. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You ready to go? Lord knows I love you, Gabrielle, but you know how I feel about it, and you went and did it anyhow. Never order a paternity test behind your back. So now I'm confused. Why did the clinic call and say my results would be ready tomorrow? I have no idea. Wait a minute. Did you send in a sample? Well, it's not ideal, but it's done. All right, at least now we'll know for sure. For the last time, Gabrielle, Keisha is my child. I don't need a paternity test to tell me that. I understand. Hey, I'm sorry you had to hear all that. No, she's just trying to protect her family. Your family? You have a place here. Do I? I mean, I came from nowhere. Look, I understand if you feel like you don't owe me anything. Oh. Keisha, I'm your father. You need anything. I'm here for you. <sighs> what is it? I'm just so ashamed. Ashamed? What? I made a lot of mistakes in my life. Evicted. I still owe my landlord money. Credit is a mess. I, I couldn't even afford to put Daisy in the ground. You tell me how much you need. I'm happy to help. Come on. Let's go get the check. <laughs> Come on, Lord. You're a blessing business. Come on. Come on. One second, honey. Yes, 8 a.m. sharp. Thanks. Good night. Gabrielle. Yes? Is it just me, or does it seem like this whole thing is happening a little too fast? With Keisha? I don't know. I think she's fitting in nicely with the family. Yeah, I hear you. i just like to know who's in my home and around my daughter. Well, I think it's nice having her around. She's harmless. She was asking a lot of baseless questions in the car about work, money, justice. She's probably just starstruck. It's not her fault you're so touchy about him. So many roads. Let's not go down that one. Well, Daddy's happy, and I know that he wants to make up for lost time, so... 
Right. Uh, I'm gonna go check on Bella. No, I you. will check on our daughter. Jones is a 99.9% .9 match. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I told you. <laughs> I'm going to move my girls to the state house. <laughs> We're going to go back out and celebrate a little bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, let's go. Sometimes it can make you want to change your life. Sometimes, sometimes, sometimes. Mm -hmm. Everything's amazing. Thank you. Wow, you look nice tonight. Oh, she's beautiful. My two beautiful daughters. Keisha, I'm so glad Daisy's letter brought you into our lives. I don't mean to pressure you. I've been thinking. You think you might consider staying here in Atlanta? You want me to stay here with y'all? Why not? Your family. Uh, I, I got a job back home. Oh, I... Heck, you can get one here. <laughs> um, could we help with that? Um, well. For real? Yeah. You're a bright young woman. I'm sure we'll find something. Hmm. I, I got a good contact down at the car dealership. Thinking Keisha might like her own car. Y'all would just take me in just like that? I, I don't know what to say. Say I'll stay. God, <laughs> yeah, I, I really don't, don't know what to say. Well, ever since I got Daisy's letter, I've been overwhelmed by guilt. After all this lost time, I just want to make things right. I used to pray for I used to pray for this. I believe God heard. Oh, look at my baby. What's up, baby? <laughs> Q got us swimming in cash. I told you. We live in big time, girl. Nah, we just getting started, okay? I got keys to Gabby's house. And I got a new job running things. What that mean? It means that they want me. They want to make things right. Just like that? Are you forgetting about everything you and your mama done been through? Huh? Look, you in too deep, baby. Now, you forgetting the plan. No, I'm not forgetting. It's just this is better. I'm finally living the life I'm supposed to live. If there's one thing Daisy taught me, is to take care of myself. One more start. Right here. Where? OK. OK, got okay. it. Okay, keep going. Keep going. What is it? What is it? Oh. Your eyes OK. Closed. All right. OK. OK. <laughs> OK. Hold on. Oh, my God. What Hold is on. That? OK. All right. Stay right there. Right here? OK. OK. Keep your eyes closed. OK. Open your eyes. No, no, no. That's my car. <laughs> Wow, 
Wow! Surprise! It's great, isn't it? <laughs> Thank you. It's perfect for you. Daddy and I picked it out ourselves. We're so glad that you love it. <laughs> All right, big day. We gotta get going. Okay. It's so cute, isn't it? Look at it. You're gonna look so good in it. to stop by Dior to pick up an order, and then we will swing by Spinless for your new clothes. Oh, but y'all can have a DJ? Yeah. You play ping pong? No, but I, I guess I'll try. This is legit. Day, do you want to get her set up? She'll be with us for a while. I got a big presentation with Jesse's today. Today? Yeah. Oh my God. Wish me luck. <laughs> Good luck. Does everyone get one of those? Yeah. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah, everything's fine. I don't trust her. Can we just focus on the meeting, please? Can we focus on not letting a stranger into our business? I understand how you feel. All okay, right. Megan, like, just talk to me, please. <laughs> we need to get this right. I understand that. We could lose one of our biggest clients. I know. But I do love your pitch. It's really good. Yeah, and most of them are Keisha's ideas. She should be in this meeting. I'm not gonna allow a stranger to come into our office. Our company depends on this. Yeah, but I'm just trying to do the right thing. I, I, I know I may have just met her, but... She's my sister, Reagan. It just feels wrong. It's simple. We're sticking to my plan. When Justice gets here, Keisha's not gonna be in this office. The one, the only, Justice Collins. Ah, <laughs> ring in. Are you ready for this presentation? The question is, oh, are you ready? <laughs> oh, I stay ready. Okay. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Justice. Hold back, hold back. I thought this was supposed to be a fan free zone. Um, Keisha, she's new. Huh. Okay, we good, Smokey. Oh, that was cool. Um, you're gonna be so excited because I'm excited because we have a new strategy. Hey! hey. Uh. <laughs> wow. Um, I need you to go get coffee. Well, what about the meeting? That's above your pay grade. He loves the lattes down the street. I'll text you the order. Thank you. Mm. Welcome. So it's a sneaker release and a scavenger hunt. Megan, I never got your text, so I did a little digging on Justice's social media to get the orders right. Double shot, no harm. Great home. job. Um, Keisha, I must have forgot to text you. I'm sorry. Keisha? Um, I'm sorry. Gabby, now I know we go way back, and I gave you the seed money to start your company, but I gotta be honest with you. I was starting to doubt you. But this, this is so fresh, I cannot wait. Great job. Great job. The pitch was based off something that Keisha told me in the car the other day. Really good ideas, Keisha. Oh, I hear you. Okay, well, look, hey. Great job. Great job, y'all. Thank you. Uh, I'm glad that you like it. Um, excuse me. Be 
business, her money, and her family. She ain't gonna know what hit her. Hey, boo. We back on. Come on, babe. Come on, we gotta do this for the justice campaign. I get it. But shouldn't Keisha go instead? She's a part of it now. No, not for this. And Reagan's already pissed about her joining the company. Come on, let's go. Oh, uh, okay. oh uh, Keisha, you know what I mean, right? Yeah, it's cool. Look, I'm happy to watch Bella. It's no problem. Great. Save me. Stop it. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Don't wait Have up. Have fun. Thanks. All right. <laughs> Who are you wearing tonight, Miss Wilson? Oh, me? <laughs> oh, Vida, Vida, hi. I'm Keisha. Nice to meet you. Yeah, let's take some pics. What are you doing? trying to make Gabrielle happy and nothing is working. She didn't even want me at the meeting with Justice. She sent me to go get coffee. And look, I know that, that he's giving money to the company wait, and- Wait, wait, what? Yeah, he said seed donors. He gave them the money to start the company. Didn't you know? Wow, I can't, I can't believe she didn't tell me that. She's very protective of it. Yeah, don't I know it? I mean, um... Hey, look, it, It's not personal, okay? Don't let him get to you. I just don't want to let Gabrielle down. I just wanted to feel better. That's why I put the dress on. Hey, I understand, okay? Just... Talk to her first next time, okay? Oh, please don't tell her. Look, I, I'm just trying to do everything perfect for her. Hey. Keep your chin up, okay? No one's perfect. Come on, up. Up, up. You're doing just fine, all right? Come on, let me out. Babe, did you find the tickets? Yeah, I'm coming now. You okay? Yeah. All right. Take the dress off so you don't get in trouble, okay? Bella, you get the first pick. Which cookie do you want? Mommy doesn't like me to have them. Where is Gabby? Cookie Monster can have half a cookie. Well, she's always at these days. Pop's working. Cheers. Yeah. I made it. Mm. Whoa, what's hey. going on here? Mommy, mommy. Hi, honey. What's going on? What are you up come, to? Come, come. We make cookies for my bake sale. Oh, and, and you got to try them. They're amazing. Oh, my God. Mm. Oh. Chef Bella. Here. Mm -hmm. All right, ready? Let's do a drum roll, Bella. Here you go, Bella. Mm -hmm. Ow. Whoa. Whoa. Mm. Mean moms. Yeah, I hope that it's okay. I, I just knew that you were working late and everything. Huh? Yeah, no, it's fine. I have to prep for the justice meeting tomorrow. Oh, maybe you can sit in this time. Wait, you, you're coming to the bake sale tonight, right? Look, I can go with Mauricio and Bella. I, I love hanging out with you guys, and 
Family is everything, right, fella? Hey. There you go, there you go. You know what? Saturday, ice cream on me, taking everyone. Oh, yes. 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 <laughs> uh, hey, Gabrielle, stop making promises you can't keep, okay? Um, let's finish wrapping up these cookies, why don't we? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, exceeded expectations, but I still have to give my final approval. Can you have it on my desk tomorrow by 9 a.m.? Yes, I'm gonna call you back. Okay, thanks, talk soon. Oh, yes. Cream or no sugar? Oh, thank you. <laughs> no problem. So how was the bake sale? It was great. I mean, Bella had such a good time. I just had a hard time keeping those moms off Mauricio. I mean, those ladies. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> um, anyways, enjoy. Good night. Good night. <laughs> I must have slept straight through my alarm. Is Justice even still? Justice is gone. What? How bad is it? Not bad at all, actually. <laughs> Little Miss Thing here did the presentation. What do you mean, what? Oh, yeah, I mean, you weren't answering your phone and Justice was ready to walk out of here. You've worked so hard on this, it didn't feel right to let you lose the account. I mean, how did you, how did you even? You know what, um, thank you. Right, same as you got mine. You still upset? Just bugs me that Keisha was so ready to take my place. Sounded like she saved the day to me. You know, little Reagan thinks she's up to something. Mm. Keisha thinks the world that you'd be happy. Oh, really? Since when are you so pro Keisha? Well, look, I wasn't going to say anything, but the other day, I found her in your closet, trying on your clothes. What? Don't make a big deal about this. It is a big deal. She has no business touching my things. I was trying to fit in. She wants to make an impression on her big sister. I think you may be holding her back just a little bit. You know what? A couple of good ideas does not make her an expert. Keisha's got a lot to learn. Hmm. By being Justice's coffee girl. Noted. Here we go. I'm sorry. It is just obnoxiously clear that you put him above everything and everyone else. That is not true. He is our biggest client. And he's also your ex. Oh, you really need to get over that. It was years ago. You want me to get over it? <laughs> All right, so, so why didn't you tell me that he financed your business? You told me that Reagan's pops gave you the cash to start the business. Why? Why would you lie to me? This isn't even supposed to be about justice, okay? It's about Keisha. My bad, you are absolutely right. You screwed up. Show her a little gratitude. What's 
What's going on? Oh my God, is that justice? Yeah, just a little celebratory brunch to welcome you to the agency. Hey, hey. <laughs> you are something special. I should have known you two were sisters here. Oh. We are so, so proud of you. Come here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, mm. you two known each other for a while? <laughs> oh. Forever. <laughs> so I asked Gabby to marry me when I was 13 for the first time. And then I asked her about mm, 15,000 times after that, and every single time she said no. You were never serious. What are you talking about? I was crazy about you. I gotta get to choir practice. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see y'all at church tomorrow. Having lunch after, right? Of course. Okay. Good to see you, Pops. You too. Hi, Daddy. Bye-bye. <clears throat> okay to talk shop? Yep. Great. So look, I was thinking about the sneaker launch next week. Next week? Oh, I guess you weren't CC'd on that email yesterday. Um, the Jay Collins have been getting so much attention on Pixel Post. Justice wants to drop them sooner, so we're gonna... <laughs> it's great. Yeah. Um, I just wish that we would have talked about this before Keisha ran with it. Now, Gabby, look, you know you one of the smartest women I know. You're my ride or die, right? But I do believe that Keisha should take point on this campaign. For real? For real. Oh, my God. <laughs> no way. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, Gabby, only if you're cool with it. Yeah. Uh, you've shown real initiative. Of course it's fine. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> so what's your plan? Well, a premiere party? with a pop-up store. I mean, his social media is already blowing up. And, get this, we invite Veda Laurelton. Mm. Who's Veda Laurelton? She's the new social media gossip queen. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh, well, I think that went well. There appears to be a significant amount of money missing from our accounts. What? What do you mean? How much? Uh, well, they're pretty good at what they do, because they didn't take a ton at once. Roughly $500 daily for a few weeks, give or take. Do they know who did it? No. Uh, right now it's under investigation, but I needed to close our accounts. Depending on what they find, <laughs> hopefully we get our money back. Yeah, I mean, I hope so, too. That's really horrible. Hi. Oh, sorry. <laughs> mm. On a lot of... Oh, my God, so fine. Wait, God. what? We were just... Keisha. <laughs> Keisha, uh, can you give us a moment, please? Sure. Yeah. So let me get this straight. It's not enough that you have to work with him during the week. No, you have to have brunch with him on the weekends as well. I don't get it. At what point are Bella and I a priority in this equation? Baby, you know that you and Bella are my world. You say that, but your actions don't match. You see, there are plenty of times that I know firsthand where this family comes behind your career. Now, this isn't even about my career. It's about justice. Oh, yeah, I can't put anything past you, can I? Look, right now, I need you to be honest with me. Did you hook up with Justice when we broke up six years ago? How many times are you going to ask me this? You're not answering the question. Because we've been over it. Well, then how about we go over it again? I just found out that he gave you money to start your business. You had plenty of time to tell me about that. Did you hook up with Justice or not? You know, it absolutely destroys me to think that there is a possibility that Bella is in her mind. Don't you ever say that to me again. Daddy, Daddy, can I have some milk? Sure, baby, of course. <clears throat> um, and I'll get some milk. Get you some milk and some cookies, because mommy's going to get you cookies.
right now. Let's give it up for the praise team. Come on, somebody. Don't they sound good? All right. Everybody can have a seat real quick. Now, I know that day has been long, but it's been a wonderful Sunday. I'm not going to keep you much longer because I know you want to get out into the world on this Sunday afternoon and have a good time doing what people do on Sunday. Today, I have a word for somebody. Amen. Amen. Reading from Philippians verse 2, chapter 3. Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility, value others above yourself. Ambition is what we do to promote ourselves. But when our ambition becomes your primary agenda, uh huh, we will compromise our values to what? To attain any kind of success. Amen. And that's a dangerous thing to do right now when, when, you, when you have so much aim to attain success. Amen, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Y'all don't hear me. Flores is also your baby mom. And that's her right there, isn't it? What are you talking about? Are you helping take care of your daughter? You did with yourself. Mrs. Wilson Flores, is that your official statement? You need to get the hell out of here right now. So are you denying that the two of you were ever involved? Justice, is it true that Gabby is the one that got away? <laughs> A gentleman never tells. <laughs> What'd you say? You heard what I said. Reagan's taking Keisha and Bella home. Let me see that. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. You know, I put up with a lot, Gabrielle. But it absolutely kills me that you ever with that dude. We were broken up. And I was upset. And you thought it was a good idea to run to justice when we broke up. That's what caused all of this. Forget justice, okay? I am your wife. Listen to me. I'm yours. I'm yours. Only yours. Prove it. It's just stop representing justice. We've been through this. Without him, I do not have a business. If it weren't for him, you'll survive. Our agency is all about image. Like, how would it look if I dropped my biggest client? Gabrielle, it's him or me. I won't choose. What are you doing? Making it easy for you. I'll stop by the house later to pick up my things. Wait, come up, Mauricio, please. Look, I just, I need to take a walk. Take the car whenever you're done here. Mm. 
Oh, man. Keisha, how much of that did you hear? I wasn't snooping. No, we weren't exactly being discreet. Now, are you really going to leave Gabrielle? Keisha, no. Look, just, um, uh, find Reagan and take Bella home. I need to clear my head. You crossed the line. Oh, God. Me. Your husband almost tanked my event. I should sue his ass. You provoked him. And now, your little act? It may have cost me my marriage. Gabby, I'm sorry. Listen, I would never do anything to hurt you. Look at me. The only reason why the Bella stuff came up is because Keisha asked me about it. That's it. She convinced me. What? She made me think that Bella could be mine. What do you mean? It's been in my head ever since. I'm sorry. Hey, Mauricio, I know that you're mad, but can you please just call me back? We really need to talk. All right, I love you. Hey, who told you about Bella? No, baby, she's busy. She's always busy. Yeah, but I'm here for you. Bella, you know I love you very much, right? I love you too, Auntie Keisha. <laughs> if you want, you can call me mommy. Or... Mama Keisha. Okay. Let's get you back to bed, okay? Hello? You were right about her all along. Who? Keisha? Ada's been getting all of her info from Keisha. And after talking to Justice, I think she's been trying to destroy my family since the day- How would she do that? Envy. She wants to be you. Reagan, where is my daughter? Oh, oh my God, I, I left her alone with Keisha. I'm headed back. In light of the recent events, the recent conflict at the J. Collins event, I will be transferring all my clients to Keisha. vicious paternity room is about Bella. <laughs> but you've got no proof. Oh, but Gabrielle does. <sighs> and now she sees you for who you truly are. Look, Beta is a liar. You can't trust anything she says. Oh, so I suppose that Justice is a liar too, huh? <sighs> Look, it's a misunderstanding. Shut up! Get out my way! Come on. I'm just, just, 
watch your step. Come on, it's okay. Just watch your step. I got you. 911, what's the nature of your emergency? The address is 5555 five, 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 Wilton Place. Please hurry. She's pregnant. Yes, ma'am. Emergency personnel on their way. Jesus saved me from myself Cause I need your help Elijah I can't do it. I can't face them. Keisha, we are family. Please don't call me Elijah. Let me be your father. What the hell does that mean? Fathers are there for their children in their sins and in their graces. I'm here. You're not alone. Let's face this together. As father and daughter. Your friend's vitals are stable and we think her baby will be okay. But we gotta get going. Okay, thank you. Miss Bella Flores. Okay, she's six years old. She's about three and a half feet tall. This is a picture that we took of her tonight, and that's the young lady that took her tonight. Oh my God, Bella! Bella! Oh my God. Kevin, I'm so sorry. Don't. You took my child. How could you? Keisha Jones. I'm sorry. Is Reagan okay? I will never forgive you. I will I'm never sorry. forgive you. I'm sorry. Stop it. It's How going to fall right. I'm, I'm, I'm coming down there. Get out of here. How could you? Let, let, let me. Let me. Oh. I'm not sweetheart, but Jesus and Granddad are looking at me. It's okay, baby. Imagine my life without you, without Bella. I know who I marry. I want to fix us. I want to fix this. I want to fix us too, and I promise that I'm going to do better with work, with with everything, with our family. Hey, I won't. Hey, I. Hey. I love you. Nothing will ever change that. I love you too. I love you so much. We're all 
all she has. And Daddy, I understand why you have to do this. You're Keisha's father. But I have to draw the line somewhere. And she took Bella. Right. I will walk in to support you. Please don't ask more of me. Keisha! 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 Hey, sir. Please move away from the door. My name is Elijah Wilson. I'm, I'm here to see my daughter. Gonna need some help in here. All right, sir. Sorry, this is not where we usually hold the inmates. Today seems to have an overflow. You use that little walkie-talkie thing to call your boss. I will see my daughter. If it helps, you're not alone anymore. Your family. You have a place here. I used to pray for, I used to pray for this. I already told the lawyer I'm staying. You can't change my mind. Why do you keep punishing yourself? You made mistakes. But you deserve forgiveness. All the terrible things I've done to you. When I came into your lives, it was all based on a lie. Everything you feel for me is based on a lie. Daisy brought you into our lives. It was the last thing she did. No. That letter from Daisy. I wrote it. And I sent it. She told you? No. I found you myself. I sent it because I wanted what I thought y'all owed me. But, but, Keisha. Daisy did write the letter. Someone from the hospital sent the Bible with the letter in it. You wrote a new letter. And you sent it. But, God doesn't love us cause we're perfect. He loves us even though we're not. He's forgiven me for abandoning you. And he's forgiven you for what you've done. As much pain you've caused me, I can see that you're in pain too. We need to heal together as a family. There's always hope. I'm sorry. Gabrielle, I'm so sorry. I know. You're my sister. Come on, let's let's pray. Our Father, who art in heaven. Oh, Lord. 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 Thank <laughs> you.